Okay, so today I'll be showing you how to install Skyrimcraft. First, you're going to need uh, WinRAR. Just uh, install one of these versions. <coughs> okay, now we're going to, once you've installed WinRAR, go to the mod loader link. They'll all be in the description. And download it. So come down here, mod loader, direct or adfly, whatever. These have adverts, so they get like a tiny bit of money for each <coughs> um, click they get. So wait a few seconds, press skip add, and press uh, save file, so download it. Okay? So you don't need that anymore, so get rid of that tab. Okay, so go into your downloads. Actually, no, wait. <coughs> okay, so next you're gonna need Player API client. So I'll send you. I'll send the link. It'll be in the description. Uh, click download and click save file. Uh, get rid of the pop up as well. And next, and finally, we'll need Skyrim Craft. Uh, go up. It'll, it'll, you'll start here. Um, <coughs> scroll down a bit. <coughs> tells you everything you need. Uh, and then click download Skyrim Crafts version 1.3. Click save file. And that'll download. Okay, so now we need to go into the start bar. And we need to click percent. And you do that by clicking shift and five app data percent okay and it'll bring you to this place this location and you click on that minecraft and go into bin and then you hear here you have your minecraft version uh before you do any modding in case had any you get a black screen or anything does go wrong you want to uh copy this copy the one that says minecraft uh click uh, copy. Go uh, go back uh, and create new, and call it black backup. I've already done this, so go into your backup one and paste. Uh, that won't come up. So now you'll have. In case something goes wrong, you can just go back to this, and you'll be alright. Okay, so to open up. The Minecraft files, you need to do it with more. So you right click, open with uh, WinRAR. Uh, and once you've done it once, it'll load as heaven. And now here are the files of Minecraft. Now you see this one here, meta inf. You need to right click, delete files because no mods can work with that. So uh size it minimize this and let's go to our downloads and get where is it mod loader okay so double um double click open it and resize it like that get up the minecraft and you see all the in the mod loader that's if you see all the class files highlight the class files <coughs> And you have to delete meta inf or this won't work and drag them in. And you also have to install mod loader first. Um, so let's go into our downloads again. And now we need player API. What is it? Oh, here it is. Hold on. Just give me a second. Okay, so here. Uh, double click so that's opened here we have more class files we have two text documents uh, this just tells you how to install uh, so copy all the class files you see here we have uh, five class files and highlight the class files it probably doesn't matter if you drag in the dot text but I guess don't take any chances um, so now that mod loader and play or player API is installed uh, get Skyrimcraft, double click, and resize. So 
you see here it says Skymcraft version 1.3 double click on that and then you have all these <coughs> files now you, you can highlight them but it's kind of hard to get from the bottom oh I just did it but if you can do it the way I did it or you can do control and then press A and it'll highlight everything so now uh, everything is highlighted so drag everything into here and it should should be installed um okay so let's open up minecraft oh yeah it has it's worked so here we are we have all these the uh, the um Skyrimcraft website, you know, donate if you want. Uh, texture pack, it's the same pretty much. And then multiplayer is just normal multiplayer, so you could join anything. And you click play Skyrim. Uh, click on your world. I don't have too many items. Watch my tutorial on that or play in creative. And we'll see, we'll scroll down. And we'll have all these new things. So, Elven Sword, Dwarven Sword, a lot of items from. Skyrim. <clears throat> All these, you know, pickaxes, daggers. So let's get out this elven sword. Let's see how powerful it is. If we could find something to kill. Here we are. I know with this dwarven sword, it only took one hit. Yeah, I think they're all pretty powerful. Uh, but they're obviously quite hard to get if you're playing this legit. Okay, so thanks for watching, remember to comment on the video, rate the video, and subscribe. See ya.